In this video, you will learn the different levels of access to view resident information and how to request that access. There are two types of access to a resident's data and information. Number one, contact access, and number two, profile access. Contact access is provided once residents create an account in the system. These residents are shown when you search by last name, first name, and date of birth in the client search. Profile access provides more information about the resident, like state program enrollment status. Residents that you have obtained full profile access are shown in the full profile results. To request permission to view a resident's profile, first search for the resident and then select Request Consent on the dropdown. Permission to view the resident's profile can be obtained in three ways, email, text, and verbally. Select email to request consent by sending an email to the resident that they can respond to. After a resident approves your request for consent, the resident will appear in your full profile tab. You can also select text to request consent via text message if the resident indicated their notification preferences were that they want to receive text messages from Connect resources. You may also select verbal to request consent verbally from the resident if you are speaking with them over the phone or in person. When requesting verbal consent, you must read the consent form aloud to the resident word for word. Residents can revoke access to their profile at any time within the privacy settings screen in the system. When consent is revoked, the resident profile will turn to a contact profile displaying only their contact information to you as a partner. You can request permission to their profile again in the event that this consent was revoked in error using the same process described in this video. The privacy of the residents and their information is very important, 